Greetings and salutations, I'm Keb. Welcome back to this Let's Play of Caesar 3, where the city of Londinium is definitely shaping up. Let's see now, we should probably start working on other little thing with Bob's. Oh! 200 employees short now. That is a bit troublesome. That's a bit more than I expected. Then again, I did land at Zillion Farms, so I suppose I should have expected something of that nature. Mm, do I want to expand the city even more? I mean, I could, but... Oh, yeah, here we see why. Ah, speaking of food access... Where's the market and why aren't you getting the food into the town? Okay, fine. Another market is desperately needed here. You won't need a Colosseum ever, so that's fine. And you should probably have a granary on this side. Yeah, that kind of explains why we suddenly were short of labor. And there's a bit of food here as well. Because we're trying to get food from this granary, which by both of you. Um, okay, two more granaries. And some plazas. I mean, why not? We can afford it now. Let's plaza the town. Or something nice too. Gotta spend the money on something, right? So you were thrown out too. That's because of a lack of furniture. Yeah, but there should be plenty of furniture here, so... Yeah, that's not too far away from the market. That should be fine. Lacking food on the other end is not so much... Not fine at all. Um, so the one ground in there. There's no real room for me. Elsewhere. Oh, there's room for market there. Enough food, but uh, collapsed building. Well, boo. So the engineer didn't walk past here. Oh well. I could try to make a corner engineering shop here. He might go down that way. Try to stave off a repeat of that. Can you tell me you guys are still have access to wheat? Yes. I'm not short of wheat, so we shouldn't evolve anytime soon. 
So right now it's just a matter of making sure that the uh, old town, so to speak, is uh, fully fed. Seems to be our chief concern right now. Beautify the area. If you want to live here, come on. All these lovely statues. Do they have a barber shop somewhere? Uh, I can't even see that, but I can always check the opening. So let's see. Uh, that's gonna be health. Barber access. You don't have barber access. Well then, there we go. Now you do. You don't have furniture, right? Yeah. Okay, now it's just a matter of making these marketplaces actually fetch all the food they need. Yeah, these meat farms might have to expand more meat farms up here. once we have the labor force for it, which we are going to have, meaning the people are moving back in. As for the other ratings, let's see. Prosperity is almost where it has to be, which is pretty darn good. Peace will still need time for that one. Favor is also going up. And I forgot the festivals again. Um, <laughs> what about my own wealth? Well, that's not too bad, 4,800. I'm basically thinking about saving up money for the next map, because <laughs> we definitely need the extra money. So I just want to make sure that I have it available. Okay, come on. Move back into town, you can do it. This is what really annoys me when you build far from the exit, from the entry point. Because all the people that are thrown out of their home walk outside and they'll walk all the way to the exit point and then they'll decide whether to come back into the town if there's a new space available. That's a lot of time. It's a, lot of, it's a big round, it's a long round trip. And you lost access to nothing, okay. Food shortage, by the looks of things. I don't think you can see how many homes you have available, unfortunately. That's one stat you can't see. It would have been useful. Yeah, the poor people are trying to get food wherever they can. Why? Oh, now you ran out of pottery, because, yes, of course, because they've been trying to get food all the time. So they kind of ignored pottery. Um, you know what, let's set up another warehouse here. For pottery only. And a few small statues to... Make sure that this area doesn't completely implode because of the presence of the storage house there. Room for a large statue here. In you go. where they decide to rise up. There we go. Um, <laughs> Legions, march. And 
please hurry because these guys are right next door to me. Uh, yeah, exactly. That's a bit of a problem. I mean, we have the forces to repel that, no doubt about that, but because they were right next door to our town, they began to destroy it immediately. Our legions move slowly. I suppose I can build a large wall on the outside here. I think I'm going to do that just to protect the town. Because otherwise they'll do that. this. What was that fanfare? Employees needed, you don't say. <laughs> Wait a second, that's... okay. Probably cave it. I'm starting to wonder if there are more barbarians around. It's always the same cave it. Always this one. I don't think it's tied to that specific square, it's just... A random event. Now for the walls. Let's see if we can prevent this from happening again. We don't need this forest. gatehouse out this way. Okay, let's make a road and make a gatehouse over here. Just so we can exit the wall here. to the local area, but I think they're gonna see. I think you're gonna be okay with this. We're just gonna build a few statues. Take you that way. At least it'll slow them down a bit. Okay, how are we doing now? Sort of 25 employees. Another 500 people, I don't know if we're gonna... We might need another square then. How many people in a single one of these buildings? That's 80 occupants, so if I can squeeze in a few more of those... Would actually suffice. Um, what about down here? We're not gonna add Colosseums, so let's see. Okay, well, we'll that's on the other side of the road. Um, there's no room for that there then. What about here? Kind of the same situation, but I can squeeze in a bump on the corner there. Maybe room for homes here. There. Same thing, I suppose we have water, yes we do. Oh, 
two homes there. Hopefully then we'll have enough food for these guys. That's the question. I mean, if we add more homes, we are gonna add to the whole boom-bust cycle for food, if we're not careful. Yeah, I think we're gonna be good on population, so let's try for the other stats. We have some unemployment, we probably want a few wheat farms here. Need to just ease the burden. We don't need to have a road around that. Go there then. Ah, whoops. No. No matter. There we go. And one down there. There's a few more weed farms. Hopefully that's going to keep this part of town fed. I'm not certain because all the granaries seem a bit depleted on this side. I'm not that surprised, I mean, the breadbasket is on the other side. More or less. And all the granaries here are set to fetch and they'll all try to fetch from the same area, so... <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna need more farms here. So I'm gonna focus on that first. Before I start working on stats, I just wanna make darn sure we don't end up in another boom bust cycle. bread. More bread for the masses. And there we go. That's 10,000 citizens. Not bad. Um, probably need a few more workers. Engineers and prefects and employees, right? No enemies closing. Okay, fine. Okay, that done. Let's have a look at our stats. We are gonna have to work on culture, academies. Okay. Wait, did peace go down? Oh, I believe that was because of the destruction of our. Yeah, those few buildings might have reduced our peaceful nature. Oh well. Uh, da, 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 da. We're gonna go with uh, academies. Yes, yes, yes. We wanted to raise our standards here a bit. An academy for you. And the Academy Award goes to... Londinium. For more than one unit. Let's go there. There'll definitely be enough of the academies here. That's employees. As expected. That's fine. What's next? Schools. Okay. There's one. Yeah, these two don't have access to schools, but there's no real way for me to squeeze in a school here. Except there, I can try. Uh, why did you devolve? 
Oh, it's just a pottery access thing. Okay, fine. And we just need a few more schools because that's a number of buildings kind of thing, not coverage. I'm just tossing a, school, a few schools here and there. Up is uh, still schools. Feels kind of silly, but that's how the game works. Basically, you have the counter for uh, uh, yeah, the, the, the counter for the access of it, and then for how many, uh, how much capacity you have in total. So. Even if you can spread out, even if you can reach the whole town with just a very few of these things, um, you still have the ratings to match the ones that are. Where the heck are they? Let's see, education, where is it? There we go. This one. City coverage is average because of this. So, yeah, at any rate, um, we saw some displays. Dogs. <laughs> The population has increased, and that kind of dips things against us again. But we're gonna make a few oracles, I think, and rectify that situation. <laughs> uh, now we don't have the marble for it. Fine, let's import marble. And iron, yeah, everything there is imported. Oh, and this has to be set differently. <laughs> I haven't adjusted this one. Uh, export over 40. And just to balance that out, export over 16 timber. That's fine. I actually set this even higher. I'm doing this because we need pottery to just fuel the city at this point. We don't need the income from selling pottery. I'm getting more money from basically taxing these wealthy homes. And look at this. Over a thousand denarii in just six months. So, yeah. That's a lot of cash from taxes. And it would suck for to lose all of this because we ran short of pottery. <laughs> And it looks like we're actually getting there, so... Hopefully we'll fix this in time. Can't afford to sell our pottery. Now we're complaining about theaters. I guess we'll make a bit of a Broadway here. Keep me entertained. I mean, I'm the most valuable citizen in town, right? Need to, to make darn sure that I'm entertained. There we go. as fast as they can, which is unfortunately not fast enough. Going by these buildings, yeah, you're losing food too. No, we'll, we'll just have to try, try it on for size for a moment and see how things go. No, 
Now we need more libraries. And speaking of, do we have coverage for libraries everywhere? Is there any of these sections where we don't have libraries? libraries. before I forget it again. There we go. Okay. I think I'm gonna take another short break here. We'll see if we can get closer at least to the ratings next time. Thank you for watching.